Hey guys, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to convert text to vector graphics in PowerPoint 2016. Let me first show you a quick example. So here I've got two text boxes. The first one is a known vector or raster image, and the second one is a vector graphic. And if I increase the size of both these text boxes, you will notice that the known vector graphic pixelates, whereas the vector graphic remains crisp. So I've got a blank PowerPoint slide here. Let's start by adding a text box. I'll go to the Insert tab. And then I'll choose Text Box. And then I'll click on the blank slide. You will see this empty text box. I'll type some text in the text box. I'll increase the font size. And then I'll change the font. I'll use a thicker font like the Arial Black. Next, I'll insert a rectangle shape using the Insert tab. So the rectangle shape should be just enough to cover the text. I will then right click on the rectangle and send it to back. So now I've got the text box in front and the rectangle behind the text. I'm then going to click on the rectangle. And while having the control key pressed on my keyboard, I'm going to click on the text box. So essentially, I've selected both the rectangle and the text box. Next, I'm going to head over to the Format tab. And then I'm going to choose Merge Shapes. And then I'm going to choose Fragment. Then I'll just click on the blank slide to unselect everything. And then I'll click back on the rectangle. And I'll hit the Delete key on my keyboard. So essentially, you'll be left just with the text. As you can see now, I can click on the individual text items. And they are now individual vector images. I can select them all, like so and then right click and then group them together. Now as you can see this is one whole vector image and if I want to I can scale it down or increase the size. I can even change the color by going to the format tab and choosing shape fill and change it to white or yellow. Now the beauty of this is that if I scale it up and down, it is not going to pixelate. As you can see, even if I increase the size greatly, it does not pixelate. This is great if you're creating a Prezi-like effect. To learn how to create the Prezi effect, you can watch this tutorial. Well, hope you found this tutorial useful. You will find many more PowerPoint tutorials on my YouTube channel, so feel free to check in. And if you've got any questions, Please leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching.